As many of you will have seen last night, I have recently stopped drinking. It wasn't exactly the plan. In fact, it wasn't the plan at all. But I quit after my good mate, Corin Dan, staged a completely unscripted and unplanned intervention during the filming of the documentary. It has been a hell of a journey since, and I know the doco left a few lingering questions about where I'm at. So, because, so before we properly get underway tonight, I have asked Corin to take me into the confession booth. <laughs> <laughs> this should be fun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But seriously, Paddy, um, I mean, bro, six months on pretty much from what was an extraordinary conversation for both of us, um, what's it been like? What's happened? You, you haven't drunk since. Nothing. Yeah, so six months on Saturday will be six months sober for me, which is awesome. Well done, man. That's awesome. And, you know, you and I have talked a few times since, uh, you know, because we're mates. And, um, but I do want to take this opportunity now to actually say from the bottom of my heart, bro, I'm so thankful for what you said that day and what you did because you have changed my life. That's awesome, man. I yeah. really appreciate that. As you say, it wasn't, it wasn't a scripted thing. It, it happened because we were mates and we it was a remarkable thing just to have a conversation about booze because it is so difficult to do, particularly between men. And um, yeah, it was amazing. It was an amazing thing. How, you've had to keep it secret for six months. How have you done that? Well, I kept it secret from the public, but people that knew me were suspicious from the first <laughs> barbecue on the first weekend when I turned up without drinking. Like they were like, what's going on with Paddy? He's not drinking. So it hasn't been a secret from people around me, but it's been an awesome feeling um, to get it out there now and to have you know, thousands of people um, supporting me. And I'm so glad it's not a secret because I'm so proud of it. And yeah, it's man, awesome we're proud as well. And, but how do you feel? How, how have you felt? I feel amazing. Um, I just feel fantastic. I'm so much calmer. Um, I've lost a lot of weight. Um, I sleep so much better. Um, but the main thing, being honest, is that I feel in control of something. It's like I've taken control of something, and that has just given me a whole new level of vibe oh. and zest. Um, you know, I just feel like I'm in control. Do you think that'll be it? You'll never drink again, or do you think you might drink again? The workshop answer is that, um, you know, I, I hope not to drink again, but who knows what's going to happen in the future. And if I, if I do drink again, I won't drink the same way again. But the honest answer that I want to say is that I don't want to ever drink again. I've, I've worked that out myself over the last six months, and, and, and I just don't want to, bro. I just don't want That's to. That's amazing. And I just want to say how proud I am of you and how brave I think you are to have done what you've done and put yourself out there like this and I think it's inspiring and it's pretty damn awesome. Yeah, well you were the brave one. <laughs> um, you know, you confronted me and I hope that other people learn from it and um, I just want to say I love you bro and uh, give us a hug. Cheers. <laughs> nice one, mate. Good stuff.